live has started. I need silence. Okay, call in number is 515-604-9300. Access code 982-884. I wish we could shut this down. How do you do this? Watch this. Watch it one time. Watch it one time. Oh, where are your keys at, baby? Hey, come on. All right, Jamel, we about to get started, Jamel. Turn that goddamn radio off. Turn that goddamn radio off, Jamel. All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Queen Supreme Court After Show. I am your host, the T.S. Madison. I went to change dressing because my balls was getting choked the fuck out. No. <laughs> my balls were getting choked out. And, bitch, I'm here loud, live, and in color in the Marvelous Chateau with my girl, Super Sid. And baby, we are being sponsored tonight by Bo- by Skeeter's Boiling Pot. Yes. Listen, ho- hold it up, so you done been doing some damage on Skeeter. This is one plate. Damn, please. Listen, you done been <laughs> you done been doing some damage on. One plate. I got a few plates. You don't know what you're doing, but I do. I don't. Show I don't, me. I, could, I don't got time to show you. You ain't got time to show me. You gotta eat. I'm cool. Your food get cold. Yeah. You gotta eat. I'll show you later. Uh, you gonna show me later. Mm-hmm. All right, ladies and gentlemen. This yes, po- me. listen. This, this podcast was sponsored by Skeeter's Boiling Pot. Skeeters, can you tell them where to find you at, baby? Mm-hmm. Skeeters Boiling Pot follows on Instagram. Skeeters BP website www.skeetersboilingpots.com. The original pop-up bottle. You call us, we will come pull up on you and get you right. New Orleans authentic bar seafood, best flavor in the city. Yeah. Play with me. This, you listen, this shit is so spicy, bitch. My nose running like a motherfucking no, faucet. Ain't. That's that good stuff. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Look at that flavor. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Wait, wait, what mind that with um, some of my corn potatoes and all right that? Right there, right there on top. Don't jip me, don't jip me. <laughs> don't jip me on my knees, sis. All right. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we had a really good show tonight. I want to thank my guest, Super Sid. I want to say thank you for a NOLA night. We had a wonderful NOLA night. Make- what night? NOLA. There we go. Ooh, you learning these. NOLA. Listen. <laughs> <laughs> Makeup was done by NOLA. Show was sponsored mm-hmm. by NOLA. Mm-hmm. All the motherfucking... Sponsors was from NOLA. Yes. Yeah. So this was a NOLA night, and I'm an honorary NOLA citizen. A what? <laughs> <laughs> you not gonna let me be honorary NOLA citizen? I mean, you pulling off, sis. Well, what about NOLA citizen? Look, Tokyo, Tokyo said I. You call it NOLA. You call it NOLA at first, and you're not a citizen. Well, that means y'all from the projects. <laughs> Wait, hold up, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> We ain't all from the Jack, so. I will outrun the pro- <coughs> in my project. Jack, <laughs> Jack, in my project. Listen, I know you've heard the term before, keep them punks out your house, but they loaded back there in the back back there. All them queens back there. Yes. Queens, I need y'all to get out the camera. Y'all over there eating all the Skeeter's boiling pot. I mean, it's good. Get the yes. fuck out of our cameras, queen. I mean, it's good. I'm trying. <laughs> Ain't nothing over that train, nothing. Laddie, Laddie, you came all the way from Miami. We see you back there, girl. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Miami. We see Miami. you back there. Yes, Miami. We, <laughs> we see you. Okay. So, hold on. Let me get this together, y'all out there. Hold on. Somebody say, hey, Laddie. Yes, sis. I need y'all to close y'all goddamn mouths over there. Stop trade trading them. Ain't nobody having nobody tonight. Y'all need to stop doing that gay stuff. God is com- Christ is coming soon. You should like right with Christ. Get your life right with Christ. Stop having gay relations back there, y'all. Men's on men's back there. I'm straight. Look at y'all men's on men's back there. <laughs> Get to know the Lord. Stop having relations with other men. They did. They did. Girl, you got a good play. All right. Okay. Tonight on the Queen Supreme Court, we talked about some of every motherfucking thing, baby. Super, you was very opinionated about certain things. You didn't like you. You called me phony because you said that I was a, a, a Nicki Minaj fan. No. I don't. I call you phony for being a fan. I call you phony for Dicky. 
<laughs> well, I'm eating. Do I eat dick like I'm eating this turkey? I'm eating it, bitch. You was eating tonight. I love Nicki Minaj, so I don't get it. Like, what's the tea? You can love her and still be and not be biased. You can love her and still be real, bitch. You think? I am being real. <laughs> I just, <laughs> I'm just not agreeing with everything that y'all want me to agree with because you don't agree because y'all Cardi B fans. Facts, though. I mean, I'm a Nicki fan too, ho. But y'all, <laughs> y'all Cardi B fans really. I'm a Nicki fan too. We we just respect Cardi B a little bit more because bitch, we 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 seen her come up. We, I ain't I don't know where the fuck Nicki came from, bitch. I watched I watched her Cardi bitch bitch be in the strip club. Oh, I watched her come from nothing to something. So we appreciate it a little bit more. That's what we saying. But that's still unfair to Nicki. That's y'all. not unfair. We never said bitch. We never said Cardi was a better artist. We just said we respect the new artist a little. You know. What I'm you think you just dick eat because the girl called you and all that. <laughs> <laughs> she called me, she did. I can tell, bitch, that's why you dick eat. How you know, how you know, Cardi? And Cardi called you, you gonna dick eat too. How you know I ain't never talked to Cardi? Bitch, Cardi ain't calling you, bitch, I usually talk to Nikki. <laughs> Please. Call you for what, bitch? Oh my god, why y'all do those things? Well, it's the shot. Come here. Oh, Thursday. Nikki did put in way more work, we understand. But tell Nikki that, because obviously she don't fucking know that, bitch. What's what I'm saying? You said Nikki put in way more work than the ugly stripper, but obviously she don't know that, because she's still coming for Cardi. She do not come for Cardi. I'm not, I'm not. Dick eating, bitch. Bitch, <laughs> you dick eating. You dick eating right now. So she never came for Cardi? No, I'm, I'm, I'm sausage eating. A dick. It look like a dick. It tastes like one, too. <laughs> but I just feel like that Cardi, Cardi, I... I support Cardi. I don't know why people act like that I don't support Cardi B. Bitch, say two good things about Cardi. Look, hurting you. Ooh, it's hurting you, bitch. Go ahead. Two good things about Cardi. It hurt you already. Just, you know, why they gotta be quiet? Say it loud. See? Two good things about Cardi. Don't worry about it. Well, she says she gonna do what the who? <laughs> she says she gonna do what the who? How, how it go? You say, say, what you mean how it go? But you a Cardi bitch? I said I support her. And you support, you know the line, ho. The line was the most viral line. She gonna do what? Well, uh, uh, Dummy must got Dummy must got Selena. I'm in the trap, Selena. <laughs> oh, you fake. But it's okay though because you know that's how real stands are. So it's okay. I'm pretty sure Nikki gonna call you tonight. <laughs> <laughs> like, yes, yes, Madison, bitch, yes. I, I, I get it. Oh, it's a video. I get it, friend. I wish you was a fan of me like that, bitch. I am your no fan. What the hell you talking about? I want you to do this. I want you to stand behind me like that. I am your no fan, girl. I don't want a bitch to call me fat. You just too fat, fat. You know. Saying thank you, friend. Oh, am, are you telling me something? Bitch, you know I'm fat. <laughs> you is not fat, bitch. You body. Thank you. See what I'm saying? Stand, stand for me too. That's what I'm saying, friend. Okay. We also yeah. talked about little Uzi Vert tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Tonight we talked about Lil Uzi Bird <laughs> and the rich kid. And the trunk. We also talked about Coco's uh, plastic titties that she breastfeed her baby out giving the baby plastic poison. Half and half milk. Half, it is definitely half and half. <laughs> we all, what else we talked about, Craig? Mariah. We talked about Mariah's beautiful career in Vegas. Yeah. <laughs> Tevin Campbell. We talked about the way Tevin Campbell is still so fine after all these. Bitch, please. Tevin Campbell, like an old stick figure with a mustache, bitch, please. I didn't know that was Tevin. I thought that was Tevin. T-Ven. Bitch, you going to heaven soon. That was T. Oh. I can tell. Something ain't right about Tevin. Then, okay. So, who else we also talked about, Craig? Coco T. We talked about Chris Brown and Rihanna. We talked about Chris Brown and Rihanna. The girl that rolled over on her baby. We talked about the baby smasher. Tracy Moore. We talked about Tiffany Haddish, her dish. (laughs) And Brandy. And Brandy Monica. Now and we also said one gotta go. And it was Brandy, Aaliyah, Monica, and Beyonce. And I chose Monica to go. First of all, let's talk about Monica. I mean not Monica. Let's talk about Beyonce. Oh. Mm. Oh. oh, see, you about to get her brain shut down. <laughs> she ain't saying nothing yet. She ain't saying nothing yet. We done with these saying, too many times. Y'all Beyonce, get quiet. Hold on, y'all. Be quiet. I got to hear this. You see how Beyonce don't come for other artists? She don't have to, bitch. Tell Nikki to follow suit. <laughs> <laughs> 
know what I'm saying? She you don't see Beyonce her. tweeting about what other artists going through. You don't see her. She may, you know, she may, she may, you know, put herself on this pedestal, but she don't overdo it like Nicki. She don't wait till a new bitch come singing hit songs, bitch, for her to come out with a bitch. If she a fan of Beyonce, tell her follow Stu. That's all I'm saying. Beyonce knows she the queen. She don't gotta compete. Your friend don't know she the queen. We know, but she don't know. That's all I'm saying. <coughs> I, I, I like Nikki. I feel, I feel like Nikki is the best ever since right now on the chart. But she don't know that, obviously. Because she's still trying to come for little bitty Cardi. Bitch. I mean, she should have. She really should have chilled when most cars that she was pregnant. Oh, bitch. Oh, you pregnant? Okay, bitch. I'm going to chill. Because bitch, you done fucked up. Got pregnant and shit, bitch. But no, she ain't even use that. She still come out with shit playing with Cardi. Bitch, let, let Cardi live, bitch. But you're going to dick eat and be quiet. But that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't feel the same way you feel. You're not gonna feel because it's Nikki. I love Nikki, and I just feel that Nikki. <laughs> why would Nikki be? I don't know, man. Yes, I'm listening. Why what? Say. Why is she intimidated of Cardi? Because she's talking right now, and everybody is more is, is more relatable to Cardi than Nikki. We used to relate to Nikki. We don't no more. Mm-hmm. We used to relate to Nikki. We don't anymore. But that means you're fickle. No, but she. <laughs> 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 if you're fickle, it means you're fickle if you leave from Cardi, from Nikki to Cardi. We relate Just, to Cardi now. Nikki used to be, a, you know, the bitch that was hood, bitch still, you know, hanging with the niggas on the block, bitch rapping about, you know, this and all that. And, you know, we related to that shit. But what happened? What happened? She, she switched her style up, which is fine. Because, you know, you went pop. And that's good. I, just go pop, bitch. The, the bag bigger, but at least they will relate to us. They connected with us, which we don't relate. Well, what to. made you feel like that Nikki disconnected? I don't feel it. Well, I do want Roman back. All, now, when she was Roman, y'all didn't want Roman. No. First of all, when y'all when she was Roman, y'all did not want Roman. Y'all acted like Roman was too much. I like, I like Roman. I do I like Roman. Roman. When she had the pink hair, the green hair, the purple hair, the yellow hair. I dug it. You know why? I dug y'all it? acted like it was too much. Not true. I dug it because she was the only one doing that extra ass shit. Mm-hmm. Being extra, being loud, being vibrant, being herself. You know, she she was the one that introduced that gay shit. She did? No, she didn't want to have hoes voicing that they like hoes. Bitch, hoes was scared to say they like hoes. Mm-hmm. So she she made it cool. Okay, so, you know, she went to relating. You know, everybody relate now. Then she went and got a boyfriend. Mm-hmm. Who was her boyfriend? You approved of one of her boyfriends. I did. I, and that was relatable. When she was with me, that was relatable, bitch. Uh, a top knot bitch fucking with a nigga that's, you know, he's, he, he, he popping, but he not on her level. Meek wasn't on her level. Let's be real. And still not on her level. Still not, but still. But he a hood nigga from the streets that's still connected to the hood. Mm-hmm. So her giving him a chance was relatable. That's why he rode them dirt bikes in her house when he stole her shit. Allegedly. <laughs> 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 allegedly. 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 Alleg- I the side downs there, but allegedly he wrote them dirt bikes. In a house, though? In her house. In her living room. I heard that was their house. That was oh. she said. Oh. When she said that. They bikes in their house. That's his house, too, right? That was she said. They won together. The they won together. Then what she said, she said me and Meek bought a house. They won together. That's your friend. She probably told you that. Mm-hmm. She didn't tell us that, though. She told us that was her house, bitch. She told you that was her house. They won together, girl. She ain't tell us that, niece. <laughs> <laughs> she, told you that. she told us she wanted to be related and tell us her and Meek bought a house. And if you want to ride dirt bikes in his house, he can. That's his house too, right? No. Not if they're not together. It's not yours. Damn, when well, she told us, bitch. I'm trying to tell you. <laughs> <laughs> she told us her and Meek bought a house. Then we, we ran with that. We ain't find out they broke up until a bitch months later. So, okay. Well, so, you mean to tell me you're all the way team Cardi, even through no. all... I'm team female rap. I, I I fuck with. I like Nikki. I feel like Nikki is. I feel like Nikki. Bitch, Nikki the go. She, she doing her thing. <coughs> She's a better lyricist than than Cardi. But her at being salty is a bad look, niece. It's a bad look. I'm just I'm just saying. It's a bad. First of all, bitch, back in the G, niggas used to wait to drop the album when another nigga album came out. Mm-hmm. They used to wait, out of respect. I'm gonna wait. Now you know I'm gonna chill. You know you know this person dropped the album. I'm gonna wait a few months. What she did? She's not a nigga though. Bitch, she's a female artist. She's an artist. They used to wait back in the G. They used to be like, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm a chill. This person, bitch, they used to consult with each other. You know who got an album coming out? 
They used to wait. No, you bitch. are you you were the rapper, so you know soft is you know female is different than male. It has to be only one. The fe- males have it has ma- to be. Well, males have made it that way that it has to be one. Bullshit. Sure. Males work together, but the females don't. Why? Because mm. they Because they females. You understand? You you gonna dick eat all night, but it's okay. I love eating dick. I can tell. <laughs> I can tell. <laughs> bitch, you trying to make me like I don't like Nikki? I like Nikki. I love Nikki music, whether she went pop or not, but she still make good music. She make music, but she even dumbed down her style for these stupid ass hoes who don't deserve her. She really dumbed down her style for these hoes. She went on some Cardi shit. Before Cardi though. Mm-hmm. Cardi music is related because bitch we could catch on fast. Bitch we could bitch we could learn the song and bitch two two plays, bitch. And somebody <laughs> wrote it. Somebody wrote it for her. We don't care about that. That's life. That's the industry. We don't care about that. Nikki gonna lie and say she don't wrote her own music forever, bitch. That's a lie. You don't think Nikki wrote her, her music? own music since since she been in the game? Fuck no. no. And that's a fact. But okay, but don't try to shade this girl because she okay. Who cares, bitch? She popping. Okay, all right. Well, all right bitch, Beyonce write her own music. She don't claim she write her own music, do she? Mm-hmm. Beyonce said she write her own stuff. She don't gotta she say. Don't she don't she gotta don't say. publicly say it, but she Frank Ocean writes a lot of stuff for her too. Neo too. Yeah, yeah, Neo, yeah. Leo right for everybody. That's so okay. So all right. So the, to the, that make it cool, bitch. You but that's Nikki. Neo. What that mean? I want Neo to write a song for Nikki. Why? Nikki ain't gonna give him the props. She gonna say she wrote it, and she gonna text him and say, "Hey, see, I wrote this." <laughs> 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 oh my god! Oh my god! Somebody in the comment section said Safari wrote Nikki music. Oh. Oh. We don't know right. that. We wasn't mm-hmm. there. Allegedly. And even if he did, the Safari music don't sound like Nicki Music to do. Now you do know that Safari is is sounds like now you know Safari is slightly Roman. Now you know that. He was? He, slightly, he's, he's slightly Roman. Mm. <laughs> I mean it, Take your medication, Roman! Take your medication, Roman! You'll be okay. <laughs> <laughs> Stuff she said, her you said what? I said the shame was you understood some of her old lyrics after you, after you, after you caught the T, right? You caught after you caught the T with Safari, yeah. But we're not gonna sit here and act like that. This girl is not writing her. I don't know, so because I'm not there when she's in the studio. Who cares? I, I you, female right. rappers get get downgraded all the time for their music. Who cares? Just like people say, Biggie wrote, wrote Biggie wrote Kim, Kim stuff. Music, yeah. mm-hmm. Now you do you who do cares? you can hear Biggie in that song. Yeah, Queen bitch, own. supreme bitch. I feel like it's about, nigga for my it's about the presentation, bitch. right? How you pre- how you present it? Cardi same. present her music good. Nicki present that music good. I I think both it's that there's it's a place for both ladies to reign. Cardi's mm-hmm. finding the style. She's Who? finding her. She's finding Cardi's doing what? Like, what's Cardi's doing? She's, she's finding, finding a style. She's doing. what's looking hard. Cardi's first album was killer though. You we know the point. All right. Mm-hmm. Well, well, let's go on. We also talked about Kanye West tonight and mm-hmm. the support that Kanye West receives from the Caucasian community versus the African American. Mm-hmm. We all know that black people really don't buy music like that. <laughs> what we do, man? What we do? Hip hop. Well, hip hop music. They don't. They buy food stamps. <laughs> Anybody got any food stamps for sale? Hit me up so at Super Set. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just being shady, and I'm I'm open about being shady. Um, <clears throat> yeah. So we also talk, what else did we talk about, Craig? Yes, ma'am. We talked about yes, Drake's baby. Mama. We talked about Roseanne. 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 And we talked about the people needing to keep their job even after Roseanne is being fired, which I do believe that Roseanne, you know, should be gone. I, I thought Roseanne was dead ever since the movie She Devil. I did, I did <laughs> that too. Show you. you know, but I did. go to show you that she got a different audience. Mm-hmm. She, and, and everybody has, can, can thrive in their own audience. Am mm-hmm. I right? Facts. Okay. People, people think blacks just run everything. I mean, we we got a strong one of the main We have a strong, a strong, you know, a very, very strong presence in the. Now the, the black market. dollar is powerful. Very it is. powerful. We're not gonna sit up here and act like the black dollar don't have you sitting over there being a millionaire well, right black now. People also think it's because they ain't hear somebody they ain't popping. Bitch, please. <laughs> mm-hmm. Just because you ain't hear about it, don't mean this person ain't popping. But they do that all on the shade. You see on the shade room. 
when they pull somebody, say, who is this? Because you don't know them. I mean, they ain't popular. Yeah, they do me like that, it's too. It's not your audience. Yeah, right? they do me like that, too. They, they do me. demographic. Black Come. people got that bad. Oh, they ain't popular because I don't know them. Bitch, who are you? Right. Bitch, you work at Walmart. Who are you? I'm not going to know this person. Like, yes, still, man. You know, just how I said, like, I ain't know. I, I mean, it's the same thing with me. I ain't know Roseanne still was popping. That's not my audience. It's not my demographic. I don't. I don't know. I'm right, but that, but ABC gave to her show, but her mouth got it cut off mm-hmm. for her tweet. That means you can't go around here talking about black people like a dog. That's why I'm very careful about the things that I even say about black people. And you're supposed to, because like I told you earlier, wouldn't it? Girl, <laughs> but we're not gonna act like that. Black businesses, black people support black businesses as if they, like they should. We're not gonna act like that. They, they do not do that. You will get the support from from, from people way out, outside over there that sing "Hot Nigga Young" and not because black people, are, black, people are, are very black people are very hard on black businesses. Y'all don't give black businesses room to grow. Yes. Mm-hmm. Yes. Y'all don't give them chances. Mm-hmm. Right. Y'all will give uh, uh, these these white people. Buku chain, like y'all don't go calling they 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 jobs and y'all don't go sending out writing reviews on it. Y'all can't wait till a black person fuck up so y'all can talk about it. Mm-hmm. Y'all don't give us room to grow. Yeah, right. Y'all don't be like, okay, well, you know, this this a new brand, this new this. Like, like y'all don't give us them chances. Y'all, Ling Ling can fuck up your nails twelve times. And you going back? You still going back, Ling Ling? Still going back? But let but, 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 but let Kisha fuck him up. Uh, okay, right, Kisha right. out the kitchen. But let Kisha fuck you up. But let's but but let's be clear. Ling Ling gonna charge you forty five dollars. Keisha's gonna charge you ninety. And it's people like you, it's people like you that got the game fucked up because even when Keisha charged you forty dollars, you still gonna shake Keisha. No, I'm gonna go back to Keisha because no, I want because I want Keisha. You gonna, gonna shake her ankle back? No, I want. I want Keisha to go. I want Keisha to, go, I want Keisha to keep that Malaysia and Peruvian in her head because she look nice when she That's doing my nails. However, I don't want Keisha charging me ninety dollars when Ling Ling is charging me forty five for nails. Now I listen. Now let's be. Let's do. It. Super, you have an, a, a magnificent product that mm-hmm. I support. Boots. You yes, God. You have a, Come on. And let's give a round of applause. Yes. That's my good sense. Being an business, okay. business owner, like yeah. what made you separate things in your business? Did you learn from the bad business that you've had from other black business owners? Because you don't do bad business, period. I call I you by something, you send it to me. You, I don't. Like, mm-hmm. you send it to me. If something wrong, you fix it. Because before social media, I, I worked in customer service for eight years. So I know how customer service works. So I know how, you know, I know what makes the customer happy. But customers don't understand that you got to treat people, you got to treat the janitor the same way you treat the CEO. You're going to just talk down on this person, disrespect them, and go at them all the way wrong. And then you'll be all the way wrong just because they're black. Mm-hmm. You feel like this, 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 this one incident can't happen because they're black. You you straight go to social media, you straight bash them, you straight talk about them just because the first thing you say, what you say? That's why I don't support black business. Mm-hmm. Well, we do say that, you know. You shouldn't say that. Say that's why you don't support fucked up businesses, mm-hmm. if right. that's the case. It mm-hmm. don't matter if they black, white, Hispanic, it don't matter. If, if, it, if it's a fucked up business, mm-hmm. you can go to Chick-fil-A and get bad service, but you're not going to write on Instagram that, 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 that you got bad service Chick-fil-A. She you're going to be like, you're going to tell your <laughs> friend. No, you're not. You're not. You're not. You, you're just not. But if you go to a black business and have bad service, you're going gonna to get on social media and rant and rave. Mm-hmm. And you're going to say, that's why I don't support black... Y'all put too much stipulations on black business. Like, give them room to grow. And I, I can see if it's a fucked up... We don't even have fucked up customer service. And we still get the same type of bashing. Like, I just don't understand. Y'all, they be too hard on us. Mm-hmm. Well, you don't have those types of complaints in your business. Actually, at this current moment, you have white businesses stealing from you. I do. Wow. But that's been going on for years. Before the crown Yeah, been because on, you know what has been going on? Life. Got me a Cadillac, Cadillac, Cadillac. Got me a Cadillac, Cadillac car. car. Ooh, I got me a Cadillac, Cadillac, Cadillac. Look at me, mister, I'm a star. Look at me, mister, I'm a star. Now, we seen that and we had to step into the bad side, bitch. That's been going on so long you with know? things on the social media and now everybody sees it. Mm-hmm. Well, yes. Now you see this business is flourishing. Now you see this business started some shit and then you see this white business <clears throat> take this shit. And now you see it. But that's been going on since before we was born. Yeah, but, but, but social media has also been a great gateway 
Because I feel like that racism is being more exposed now. Yes. It ain't never stopped, bitch. And it's not like it's worse now. The shit being more exposed, we got social media. Just like we found a lot about these niggas that's like in the suck dick and get fucked. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm on the wrong subject. Excuse me. <laughs> but you ain't lying, though. You ain't lying. You ain't lying. I'm sorry. Excuse me. I went into a whole other direction. I'm just talking about the expose of social media. No way, 22 inches. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> 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 so you know, but uh, we also what else did we talk about, Craig? You know that was top on the list. We talked about lots of things. You know, we talked about dysfunctional marriages. Oh, we, we talked about the lady shooting her husband behind the back. Yeah, we mm. talked. We talked about the woman shooting her husband behind the back, back behind the pussy. We talked about these <laughs> things. So what we we're gonna do? Azalea. We talked about Azalea, Azalea Banks and Rupert. Oh yeah. Now wait, question. Now do you think wait, she was wrong? Hello. Oh, I'm sorry. That's me. <laughs> Damn, they calling your phone. Hello? It's you. I, I, I'm trying, oh, you trying to... No, they calling your phone. Hello? Oh. That's, that's super phony. Wait a minute. No, RuPaul, I took... Mmm, you a dick eating bitch. <laughs> dick eating. Don't Ru want to talk about it. I, I get it. No, RuPaul, I told you. Mm-hmm. Baby, secure the coin. No, Ru. No, Ru. <laughs> Ru, I'll call you back. Let me call you after this. Next time. <laughs> how you got... Right. How you got niece... How you got these phone? <laughs> okay. <laughs> How you got a super number? Okay. Research. Uh, uh, okay, Ru, I won't talk. I'm gone. All right. Okay, Who okay. Do you now. think Azalea was wrong for doing that to RuPaul? Yes, ma'am. You think so? <laughs> Why? Azalea been good for I don't like Azalea. Now. But you think she was wrong for pulling something that he copied? It if it was true, though. If, if, I was that's what I'm saying. Allegedly. I think, Allegedly I that's what I'm saying. But if they pulled it, it, it got to be some kind of truth to if it. If it is true. I think true. it's a hard thing for her, though, because she has been in so much turmoil. Yeah. And, like, she so does talk shit and start right. shit. So I think it's hard, like, if he I, if he did steal it, I'm, I'm all for it. For, for right. Get, thank you. Get his thank ass. you, But she's, in, she's put herself in a position where she's been in so much shit and talked yeah. so much Every negative week, stuff that like people are skeptical. Yeah. It's like, it's like the boy that it's like the boy that cried wolf. Your credibility at this point is shitty, boo. She That's how we only we only hear about her when she been shaking. Right. Yeah, That's and right. and just because they pulled it down mm -hmm. don't necessarily then it's they could be right. investigating it or whatever. Yeah, because I mean Facebook pulls shit down every day talking about she doing this. Right, right, girl, you gotta be like Spotify copyright on on this music, girl. Unless it's yeah. unless it's long. Rule, I told you why you call back. Rule. <laughs> <laughs> Rule. Wait, Rule, we love you here. Rule, we love Paul, you. We Rule. got a whole house for hold on, y'all. Wait, Rule, but you got a whole house for what? But no, you ain't shit. <laughs> Not me. Yeah, you call it rude. Oh he, he on white page. You yellow page. You in trouble. I just, I, I feel like if, if oh, he really on. did steal that shit, she have a right to do uh -oh. that. We don't give a fuck. Fuck is it? Because Azalea has something. Who's all want to speak to you? Bitch, I'm not in the mood. I will read you for film. No, I got to work with Rude. Wait a minute. Supi, why you like Rude? Because Super I mean, light if don't he's do wrong, he's, he's wrong. wrong. But at the end of the day, we still stop rude because we don't fuck with it. It's all allegedly. That was, you know. We tired of the well, when you listen being wishy-washy. When you listen to both of the songs, they do sound... They sound I, I, I'm I sorry, I do like do. rude. I do like... like I do like Call intros, Me Mother. But the, if you Have you listened to Call <laughs> yeah. Me Mother? Oh, we can play the bitch on Instagram. What my phone there? Hold on, it's on Apple Music or not? It's on... They call the niece. Yeah, we got... We got... I just need sis. I need Azalea Banks. I really just need her. We can listen to Call Me Mother right now. Just die. Craig, what you think? Because she's dope. Lyrically, she's dope. So you feel like RuPaul snatched from Azalea? If he snatched from her, then she has a I don't feel like RuPaul got to do that, though. Why he don't? Because he got a whole team. He might not have to, but that doesn't matter. He got a team. That's true. That's true. People say that Beyonce copied Pete. She do. She did it before. This song. And now, now listen to the beat. This part. Oh, nah. Do I don't know. People do that all the time. That's like saying, wait, wait, no, I play her. Play as Elliot. I play Elliot. This sounds like a beat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But Super, you from Nola. They, they use the same beat sometimes, all the time. But. Okay, oh, true, listen, y'all. I, I, okay, now we need to find Azalea's. What is it, the Big Big Bang? Okay, so let's go Girl, and do. Probably not yeah, even yeah, on yeah. Apple Music. This is Azalea. No, yeah, no. It, it, was, it was it was on the Big Big the Big Big Bang is on. It is. Yeah. There go right there. She, there go right she's there. Been yeah, she she's the dope. Okay, there go right there. Here's the Big Big Bang. Here we go. Can't take it from her. She's a legitimate artist. Oh, bitch, I planned. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. But wait till it part drop.
Well, damn me. Right. Oh, that's the same thing. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Only thing different is the intro. Yeah. Play both of them together, man. Play the other one, too. Damn, yeah. they look. What's the year? But how many beats is there in the world? I'm, I mean, right. It's not about the beat, but oh, the no. flow. Even like, the, the rhythm, the flow. Here go. Yeah. No, come on, man. <laughs> Come on, man. Yeah, yeah. You yeah. gotta get past this yeah. intro. She not, he not calling. This part. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, that's the same shit. Yeah. Well, it, it, it sounds like he tried to make up. They 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 just mess up the beat a little bit. It sounds like he did try to. They just. They just. They just hello. <laughs> oh, hello. 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 Stop the line. Yeah. Hello. That's the same music. So you think it sounds the same? Rule, no. Damn, Rue, I love you. But Rue, no, listen. Rue, no, listen, Rue, no. We love you, Rue. You want to speak to Craig? Uh -oh. No, they don't want to speak to Craig. <laughs> <laughs> right, the Craig. No. Somebody turn the camera on Craig. Uh, Somebody no. turn the camera on. Rue was in the room, but we don't care. We don't like Azalea. But Rue. True. Rue, she, okay, we, does, okay, Rue, we are. Whatever yeah. that cry wolf. What, which one is called? Cry wolf. Rue. Okay. Yeah. 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 Cry yeah. Wolf. Your credibility yeah. is done, sis. It's you know, it's done. Okay, how many gay people in the room? Okay, it's 90% of gay. We're ruling in your favor. Okay, Rue, bye. Right, right. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Azalea. Sorry. You don't see Rue shade all these artists. Never. You see Azalea doing this. And he a queen. He don't never shade nobody. It happens in industry. You know that. Bye bye. Bye, niece. All right, so what we're going to do now that we've done all of these things is we're going to open up the phone lines and we're going to mm. let you, the audience, call mm. in. We're not going to take lots of calls because, bitch, it's late at night and right. it's time to go. <laughs> so here we go. Jamel, let's open up the phone lines. All right, juror 9443 is the Queen Supreme Court after show, which is Honorable Judge Manny and Special Guest Super Smith. What's your name? Where you calling it from? And what's your judgment of the night's nice legend? One minute, go ahead, call. <laughs> <laughs> is it Miss Dina from New Jersey? Hey, New Jersey! <laughs> Hi, Maddie. Hi, Hi baby. <laughs> Hi, baby. You know what? Hi, Super. Hi. Let me tell you, Maddie loves you because she talks about crayon case. I'm telling you, really. Yes. <laughs> Yes. Yeah, super. I love Maddie too. I remember um, when she got some crayon kitties and they was over there fighting over that lipstick. Mm, girl, I'm surprised. <laughs> it's gone now. It's gone now, <laughs> <laughs> I, I got to send my bitch some more stuff. Yes, she do. I'm sending her some more stuff. She got to get all the new stuff. Well, like, uh, you know, all the well, new stuff that she, came out. She loves you. Tell her what she knows where I'm from. New Jersey. I that's right. That's my Jersey girl right and there. That's my... Super, my son said he knows you, DJ Slinky. Tell him I said hey. Listen, that's my girl right there. That's my jersey girl. Hey, hey, Slink. He said, he said, hey, Slink. He watching. Hey, Slink. How you doing, Slink? How you doing, my love? Love you too. I love you way more. <laughs> no, no need. No, no need. Show that rock. Right. Show me. Do that need. Jersey, that makes the Jersey club music. Wait, did. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. How you doing? I'll be making that right there with all the entire music. I love you super. Oh, yeah, look. It's me. She said, yeah. He's in my room. She's married. Oh, I'm mad as hell. Oh, stay mad, niece. She said, niece. Okay, let me hurry up and get my tape because I know Jamil is going to be busy. Hi, Jamil. I want to say hi to you, too. He's always there on the phone line. Um, I was going to say that, uh, oh, it's laughing season, too, because I see Laddie's in the house. Ooh, yeah. What's up, Laddie? Yeah, come on, laughing season, baby. Yes, right. <laughs> Miami. Uh, you know what? I told you last week, Maddie, I ain't feeling Kanye. Won't be feeling him no more. He had a girl. She was light, bright, and fancy and white. But he left her to go with uh whatever her name is. You know? Kim Kardashian. She know her name. You know Kim Kardashian up there talking to the president. We all get racism taken away now. She up there talking to the president. You know, them Kardashians make things go round in the world. 
goes, boy. Trump can't. Trump don't care about nobody but himself. So you know that ain't going nowhere. Right. Kim Kardashian going to that. She's making change. I think Kim Kardashian need to run for president of the United States. I think she's going to suck that dick, though. Oh, my no. God. Anyway, um, <laughs> as far as um, Nikki, I love Nikki. Right. I always will love Nikki. Nikki Me too. Is the best too. Me too. But tell her, tell her I know that. I like party, but, you know, I'm not, I'm, I'm partial. I'm not, I don't. I'm not going to say, you know, one, I'm taking one over the other, but Nikki's been around longer, and she's human. She has feelings, too. That's true. Tell her get over it. Like, <laughs> like, like, like Super said, when she be doing her makeup, she said, let the haters live. They... They make love me. Thank you. <laughs> That's right. Thank you, my baby. I love you, and I love that you always get through every week, baby. Give me some sugar. <laughs> yeah, I'm sleepy as hell. Sleep to tell you, but the I just stayed up because I wanted to talk. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Give me some sugar. Right. Mm. Thank you. 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 <laughs> Jamel will hang up on you. In 30 seconds. All right. All right. Three times. Hey, Maddie girl. Good booty Judy from D.C., honey. All right, good booty Judy. Listen, it's a room full of butch queens that just left D.C., baby. I don't know if you... I don't know if it's any booty left in D.C. <laughs> y'all listen, she said they out of fleets up there. Tell you how many fleets you took home with you, girl? Thirteen. Thirteen fleets. And there was, and there was two. There was, there was two packs. Oh, the twin packs. Yeah. Oh, you <laughs> took one for me and a friend. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Maddie. 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 Thank you
837 is the Queen Supreme Court after show with this honorable judge Maddie and special guest Super Smith. What's your name? Where you calling from? And what's your judgment on tonight's ledger? Go ahead, call. Hey, Maddie. Just wanted to make sure that you were here. Um, I so, um, I have tons of questions, so let me know which one I can ask. Come on, ask the questions. Come on. Ask them. Where are you calling? <laughs> 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 huh? Yeah. Okay. Hey, Maddie. Yeah. All right, next caller. <laughs> oh, <laughs> what happened, what what happened to Mel? Not to Mindy. Yeah. What happened? The Queen Supreme Court after show with the Honorable Judge Betty and Special Guest Susan Smith. What's your name? Where you calling from? And what's your judgment on tonight's ledger? Make sure your news gets down. She got a child. This is Asia from Chicago. Hey, Chi-Town. What's up, babe? Hey, Chi-Town. Thank you. I feel like that. I agree. Because at the end of the day, I don't care if it's my whole mama, my kids. Thank you. Friends, I'm calling the tr the people on everybody. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Bitches with children on the stand. Well, I was called by my daughter. Chi Chi was gone out of town for three days. <laughs> I called down there and I heard heavy breathing on the phone. I was okay. <laughs> she was with that man. <laughs> that sound like a stroke. Oh. Ah. Just know whatever I was doing, I was getting my point. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> Listen, I agree. The police. We don't know if that man. Now I'm okay. Now early on the show, I didn't understand what had happened, but now I Obviously. understand it. I did. not <laughs> But I know Janet just took that man for half of his billion. That ain't your business. We talking about this. So we <laughs> never know. We talking about two for the kids. We talking about the kids. Oh, okay. You <laughs> talking about the bag? Well, he was what? She was popping her pussy for him. We were popping that pussy for him. She Thank you. Not that but Janet was, but Janet, the same girl that told the man anytime, any place. So she was gonna pop that pussy. <laughs> she ain't still some free to me. Anytime. This is stupid. <laughs> Janet was right. These bitches ain't got no children. No, I don't got no kids. But and I they would, wouldn't know. I will say this. You feel me? Why have? Why let a man nut in you if you're not gonna trust him with your baby? I can, I can trust you, oh. but bitch, if I'm calling you hoe, and my baby, you, you, the first time you I, answer, my baby is cutting up to a sound that I've never heard before, and you hang up in my face, and I call you back and you don't answer. I need authority involved. I ain't got my own kids, but I agree. I say I'm even if it's my nephew, my niece, I'm ready. By I'm ready right, I'll involved. just pull up. But if Janet probably way across the country. That's how, yeah. Oh, bitch, please. Janet, stop being and on to tour. Janet, that's Janet's first right child. Thing. Janet, you know? stop being on your... Anytime. Yes. <laughs> that's Janet's first child. So she gonna... <laughs> first child. Thank you. I never heard my child cry that loud. You know so the baby was crying loud somewhere? We don't know. But all I know is if, if you don't, don't stay on the phone with me and communicate with me, <laughs> buying our child. So the baby was crying loud and Janet saying, <laughs> 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 Come on, Will. Come on, bitch. You ask me. Next call out. This bitch taking for a joke. Just <laughs> keep Big childish. <laughs> bitch, bye. Thank you, Carla. Thank you, because this bitch is big. All right. Big Carla. Carla, four, seven, six, five. It's the Queen Supreme Court after show with this honorable judge, Maddie, and special guest, the president. What's your name? Where you calling from? And what's your judgment on tonight's legend? Go ahead, Carla. I don't want to stop. Hey, Carla. 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 Hey, Carla.
Did the police even hear her when she called? Did the police even hear her when she called? Hello, hi, I'd like to report my baby's Hello. Hey. Hi, I'd like to report my baby's Hey, you know what it is? Kiki from Georgia, motherfucker, Georgia. What's up, Kiki? Listen, Kiki, hold on. Kiki, hold on. Hi, I'd like to report my baby's Bitch, you're aggravating who? Yeah. Hi, my baby. What's your question, John's girl? This is childish. You leave me. Daddy. What's your question, Nis? Hi, my baby's crying. Hello? Hello? Yes, you here? Oh, can you hear me, Queen? Yes, baby. We can hear you, babe. That's my dog, Kiki. First of all. Chichi, walk to my side. Hold on. Thank you. You're welcome, and then uh, my, uh, what I want to talk about is, I want to talk about this group called Nazaria. Now, Queen, you already know I just shared it with you how they do. I don't know why they even came for the LGBT. She already knows we're going to shut it down 100%, which is going to be blocked. We're going to make her run off the station. She ain't going to be an actress, no singer. She ain't going to be nothing. You cannot come for us. We're going to shut it all the way down. We're going to read you for fifth every day in our sleep, in your dreams, bitch. Every time you think that you're going to think about us, and you're going to remember everything we ever Yes, so I, I Number one, I wish she would have followed Prince Speak before she even started this bullshit. She would have got her little lesson before she got started. So that's a big issue. Right. Second thing, this whole jail situation and giving a nigga your coins and all that bullshit. <laughs> no, I don't do the three Bs. I'm not about to be bound for the book for no motherfucking oh, guy. So that's big. Wait, how you know she was broke though? I'm sorry. How you know she was broke? She knows that she was broke. She was broke. I'm saying so I'm giving him thousands of dollars and like he said, she's selling him a dream. He's selling her a dream. He's gonna get out and not be with her. So she's really wasting her time. I feel sorry for her. I wish she really could wake up, but that's just too much. Right. I'm not about to do all that for a motherfucker that got a double murder. What makes you think he's gonna get out, love you, and not kill you? Mm. No, he's giving yourself a death sentence and they will make the same motherfucking time. Mm. That's too much. Triple murder with you. <laughs> 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 I love you so I love you too, girl. I love you, Kiki. Thank you, baby. I agree, though. You have to go. I agree with you. Okay. Call us 0849. It's the Queen Supreme Court. I'm just here with this honorable judge, Patty, and special guest, Luke of Smith. What's your name? Where you calling from? And what's your judgment? What's your judgment? Okay, call. Hey, that's Janice Hall. Hey. Hey, Pia. Hi, baby. How you doing? Hey, it's a little warm, honey. Is you live, boy? The bitch on the, the bitch on the phone that you may now ask the question, so I guess this bitch is on. Come on, let's ask the question. <laughs> uh, 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 I, I really have, okay, I have a quick question and then a comment and then I'm done. Okay. My quick question is, uh, this, this um, thing tonight is good or whatever, and I, I just get to watch the whole show, so I was at work, so I'm going to go back and rewatch it. All right. I just want to know when you're going to go get uh, this, uh, this blame it on Quay as, uh, one of your oh, girl. I don't know, child. They got the, you know, them girls is me is they be busy. They oh y'all cut up in here, baby. Ooh, I felt it. Felt like a ghost came in. This girl, did she was just calling us? Yeah, but my comment, my comment is about and uh, party. It's a it's a comment of uh, in response to what she said earlier about what is and is not relatable. This is just my opinion. I'm not coming for anyone who is or was a stripper or anything like that, but I feel like what was relatable about Nikki is when what was women empowerment and education. She always said about how she wanted all these girls to go out, not, not ever look to no man and get their education. Everyone wants, everyone is striving to get that quick money nowadays and is satisfied with being a stripper and does not want to move forward in any part of life. And I feel like that's what's relatable about her. She's making it acceptable to be the sidekick and she's making it acceptable to get that quick pass. 
and that's the only thing that is relatable about her. Wait, what's relatable about Cardi? Is that she said what's relatable about Cardi is Cardi is if is size six. six. <gasps> what was she said? <laughs> she said something about size six. I said what I said. I said what's relatable uh-huh. about Cardi is that she's making it accessible for all these girls to uh, and aspire to be a stripper and get quick pass when Nicki Minaj. Um, uh, a oh, quick pay. Girls yeah. been doing that. Nah, Girls been doing that. Trina used to be a stripper too. Trina was, Trina was a stripper. Trina was a stripper. She been doing that. Um, she so didn't want to publicize. And Cardi always say on her lives. No. Cardi always say on her lives how she want the girls to be better than her. She don't do that. Exactly. Okay. Now I can't. I can't. You don't know Cardi. You only know Nikki. You could better know Nikki because you said, um, like you said, Nikki is all about women empowerment. That's not true. Why y'all think that's not true? What? Because Nikki Minaj is not about women empowerment. Okay, well allegedly, you know we let's keep our stuff. But to say, but to, but to say that, to say that, to say that her come up was was was, was fast though. Girl, like, wait, Barb's don't trust no man and don't rely on no man. I used to be a stripper, right? They had a lot. That was back in the day, Maddie. I know that Maddie, but you abused Nicki Minaj. So Cardi didn't. Cardi still stripping? I'm asking. She said you allowed yourself to go further, but Cardi didn't. I'm just saying. I'm, I'm asking. She's still pushing. She's not still stripping, but I feel like she's making it acceptable to me to find it. You cannot tell these bitches show up. Hey. That's not relatable. The moral of the story is you're not a bitch, but you can't tell me. I love you too, baby. Okay, I, I get I, I get what she's saying, but I don't. Because you going off somebody who you obviously like you don't know anything about. Because Cardi, 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 yeah, yeah, even me, like, like you know, I, just like I say, I don't want the girl. I, I always enforce to the girls I did in the world, like, don't, don't be, it, don't get into yeah. the whole business, don't be a hoe, don't do this stuff, but it, uh, only if those student loans get too overwhelming, bitch, suck a dick, bitch. Because they do and, get and, they don't have to, they and don't be motherfucking, girl. if you gonna suck a dick, bitch, don't let a nigga fuck you in the ass in the mouth for free. That's what I say. Cash Doll was a stripper, too. Yeah. Cash, and Cash, we'll talk about that shit. I, I love Cash, Cash Doll. She said, run me my money. Run me my money. But a lot of the female girls, they started off stripping because they know the, they know the, they know the lifestyle. Eve was, Eve, I don't know if she was a stripper, but she was something. She did something. What she was? She was something. Oh, okay. But, but that's a lot of, you know, I mean. Yeah, a lot of the girls that rap. Not just stripping, but fuck the stripping. A lot of them disrespected their bodies, period. Fuck stripping. Bitch, Kim was disrespecting herself. Like, let's be real. Kim, bitch. What did Kim do? Uh-oh. Remember when you said you would die for me? Yeah. 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 Like, like, like the way they portray themselves. Motherfucker should have never Nikki said bye to me. Like, let's be real. Like, you talking that about part. stripping. That part. You like, like, you would say women don't, don't do this, don't do that, but then you come out here with your titty out. Stop playing. And then with a the paw press You don't even want to, like, like, no. Like, you can't promote, like, a woman but do this, do no, that. No, 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 no. But this world is a male dominated situation the, the men want to see titties just like 2 Chase say so sure? girl I like them scrippers <laughs> ain't that right Chi Chi yeah, he did say that he said girl I like them scrippers yeah, yeah. 2 Chase said that that's what he said yeah, and back in the day song, song. even them other motherfuckers yeah. said don't do do don't do Put a scrap around your ankle. All I'm, I'm going too is, short, Maddie. You came down. You came down the bitch that's stripping and then go up and then go fucking praise the bitch that got that's half naked on stage. This life is popular. You, 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 it's the same thing. You go down the bitch that's stripping with a with a, with a club, bitch, but you can't a lot of clubs, but you can't show no titties. You can't show no pussy. Next time. So you in the club, pra- like you downgrading the bitch that's doing this, but then you go praise the bitch that's on stage with bitch with her titties, with her titties out, her ass out, and all that. But it's different because she not stripping. Like, that's, that's the same thing. And the thing is, you don't understand why people be stripping in the first place. You know what I'm saying? These people that be stripping a lot of times, they be taking right, care of their family. They take care of their family. That's the final move. It's the Queen Supreme Court after show. We just talked about Judge Manny and Special. Dum, da, da, dum, dum. What's your name? Where you call her from? And what's your judgment on tonight's pleasure? Go ahead, call her. Hello. Hi, baby. I am from Louisiana. Hey, so congratulations, hey, baby. Hey, girl. Thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs> I am so happy for you. I, I follow you all the time, so I know you deserve this so much. Thank you. I, I want to ask something that y'all didn't talk about. I want to ask about 
um, for Rico, whatever it is, like, um, so call her. She's body shaming, you know, big people, because I'm a big girl. I want to ask, what are your opinion about that? Who is it? It's on Spice. Spice. Uh, yeah, spice. Oh, that ugly, that Bill Cosby looking asshole. Okay, so she tried to. I don't like that. I don't like that. She definitely, she I don't like that because Toke's my girl. Tried to, but here's the thing. I mean, she she definitely, definitely tried to. But just how Spice is not small and she body shamed. A fat yeah. girl's body shame too. Body shame. I, I mean, mm-hmm. it's like, I, I hate the fact that they said body shame. Bitch, you shamed me, period. Period. Bitch, fuck the body. Bitch, period. Bitch, you play with me. But you disrespecting me, but you like you try to make it seem like you like just so much better than me. Like it's not just about body shaming because they try to make it seem like because bitch spice ain't small, spice fat, and that's fat girls call it girls fat. She is the ugly. And you know, and, and she ain't no, you know, <laughs> she ain't no easy on the eyes as bitch. Is she ugly? You know, is she ugly? You know, huh? <laughs> so come on. Okay, okay, but let's, but let's, so, let's. So she was. was. Okay, but let's be clear no, here. No, like, no, no. like when we're in a, no, like, but let's say it. When we're, when, said, when we're in a reading said, match. You know, because I don't know. Spice is, Spice was, was big, is a big artist in Jamaica. And you know, yeah, in Jamaica. Not just, like, she's a big artist. Period. Okay, well, tell I mean, her ass to stick to playing. But no, listen, hold on artist, now. So I'm not going to say But when we're reading. Because I lived for talk, and I was, I was listen, offended. But when we're reading. I, I was offended, too. Offended too. But, but but take when we're reading the body shaming. When, like when, when we're reading, you go for the jugular. When we're but reading, bitch, we go you for. Cannot. The, I'm a fat bitch, and I will talk about another. I talk bitch. about a fat bitch. Yeah, me too. Because it's a fat bitch out there in the she world. Kept coming for her. Yeah, she I know. Did. She kept. That's what made it wrong. Like you just like you doing too much. She should have took more than that purse. She should have took more than the purse that got with her. I agree. Cause and now and now that, but Tokus is it's natural. Full body natural. Never had no service. Tokyo baby. is big, beautiful, and natural. Yes. Spice. Yeah. Now go add spice. Now go add spice. Bitch How many knives big. she be on though? Bitch, I'm just saying, mm-hmm. bitch, you had more knives than salt, big. Took so out. let's just let, let's just be real. I'm, I'm just saying. Spice is a legend in Jamaica. So that's why I say we can't say she not nobody because she is. She's an international artist, and that's true. But bitch, yeah, on love hip hop, a lot of people know who spice is. She in she in the United States now. Yeah, I mean, like she she came on that wrong. Bitch, like, you know, like, you was, you was, you was, you was a very lovable person in Jamaica, and you came to the U.S. wrong. That's but all period. I'm period. Right. But being another, being another big girl, quote unquote, would mm-hmm. you sit at the table and be like, oh, she don't right. like, she need nothing no. else to eat? Right. That, right. Yeah. that was a wrong oh, no. read. Yeah, that, that, that was a wrong read. They try to okay it because she's Jamaican. Like, That's bullshit. Right. Bitch, right. it was this Yeah, I mean, that is. Talk. But, and I'm not taking up for Spice, because I love talking. I want talk, I want both of y'all at the same time, honey. I want a menage but <laughs> this is the thing right here. When we reading each other, like even us gay, like the gay folks, we say you go for the juggler, bitch. I'm gonna, we say yeah. fat. We I'm say gonna take queen. your ass out. We say even two. I don't see two ugly hoes call each other ugly. Right, that's the right, right. 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 <laughs> you know we don't. You know, but it's just reading. You know, it's just when it's getting down into the read or whatever. You know, they don't make it right. You yeah. know, because I know a fat bitch right now that I'm. I'm a fat bitch, and I told a and fat bitch, a fat bitch, motherfucking yeah. blogger. About chicken sandwiches, bitch, instead of talking about me, you fat, triple neck ass, McGilla gorilla looking motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> I agree. So, I mean, yeah, I feel like they kind of reached the that. body shame and shit. Like, that was a, like a little sympathy thing. But, but bitch, you, you, but you came for her. The main thing, you came for her too much at that table. At that table, period. Too much. She really it did. Too, it don't matter she what really you did. Say, you came for her too much and she was chilling. So, that's the, that was the main thing. Fuck her, you calling her fat because bitch, you fat too. And baby girl, you look like Bill Cosby. Sit down. Tokyo is pretty. Tokyo pretty to you, and she was mad. Oh, period. Oh, 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 we got one more Jamal, and that's it because we got one minute left. They got thirty seconds. All right, call us three zero three nine. It's the Queen Supreme Court after show. It's Honorable Judge Maddie and special guest. What's your name? Where you calling from? And what's your judgment on tonight's legend? Go ahead, call. Him. Is you live, boy? Oh, is you live, bitch? Wait, is this? Oh, 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 bitch. Oh, who is this? Yes. Who this? Hey, Maddie. Hi, baby. Hi. Hi, super. Hey, girl. Congratulations. Thank you. I appreciate it. I am the one who always Hello? Hello? All right. <laughs> well, what the hell happened? Jamel, you did not know you did. 
o'clock. Ladies and gentlemen, we're out. We're out of time, ladies and gentlemen. And like, super, I thank you so much for coming. Congratulations, thank you, my, my baby. I appreciate you. I'm, I'm coming to dance at your wedding. Please cut a rug. I'm coming to cut a rug, honey. <laughs> Come on. Listen, cut a rug. we're gone, ladies and gentlemen. Please. Please make sure you share the show. I love you guys. And we'll see you in two weeks. The show's going to be back in two weeks because I'm going to make some moves. Yes. I know that's right. How about that? And stay tuned. All right, baby. Bye. Yes.